So this is Socially Triggered, and this video I'm going to just give you a simple reason why lockdowns don't work. And it was actually um, my brother who kind of gave me the, the reasoning for this. So one of the things that we do, because we're brothers, <laughs> is we argue. And my brother, he's very left-wing, he's a professor. Uh, I'm a businessman, so I'm more right-wing. So it's it's kind of like we're very opposite in that way of thinking. And he is very pro-lockdown, pro, well, maybe not pro-lockdown. Even he sees some stupidity in it. But uh, he's very pro-Democrat, and where I'm more fond of the Republicans and Trump. Um, so one of the things we always argue about is Trump, you know, Trump is evil in his mind, and I, I say he's not that bad. <laughs> you know, he's a pretty good president, um, but you know, he's he has his opinion, and he he thinks based on you know watching MSNBC that Trump has killed America, that Trump is like you know he's killed two hundred and some odd thousand people, and I'm like no 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 Trump tried to do stuff and he gave it. The, the power to the governors to try to protect their people. And it was them that actually made the mistake. And he, you know, he always says, oh, Trump didn't act quickly enough. He didn't do enough. I said, well, he was the one who actually put in the first restrictions against China in as early as January. And basically were preventing people from coming from China and infecting Americans. And if you think about that, that's what a lockdown is in a weird way. Uh, basically, you're quarantining China and you're saying, don't leave China, stay there and don't come here. And uh, that's in a weird way, kind of like a quarantine uh, or a lockdown. And if you think about that, that's kind of what's happening now. Uh, but instead of doing it to external nations, we're doing it internally. We're locking down our individual states or individual provinces, and we're in this sort of state of lockdown. And so I was thinking about this. I was thinking about this, and his comment was that that measure that Trump did actually encouraged the spread of the virus from China to the United States. And his reasoning was that because there was this restriction, this travel restriction from China to the United States, well, people would all of a sudden want to quickly come to the United States as soon as possible in order to beat that restriction, in order to get there before the restriction gets put into place. And if you think about it, that's what lockdowns do. So right now I'm in Ontario, Canada, and we have, we have weird restrictions. So for example, Toronto has a lockdown, but just outside of Toronto, in the city that I live, uh, it's called Vaughan, and it hasn't, doesn't have a lockdown. And uh, what happens is like in Toronto, they actually have a very strict lockdown. Uh, all the shops are closed, movie theaters are closed, uh, pretty much everything is closed. And it's Christmas time. So businesses are freaking out. It's like, this is, this is when businesses need to do business. Um, and they're just freaking out. So, and also people are freaking out. They want to go Christmas shopping. They want to get out. They want to do stuff. So if you're in Toronto, what do you do? You're like, well, we're, we're locked down. But what do you do? <laughs> you actually just drive, you know, 20 minutes north and you can go shopping. You can go into a place where it's, it's all open again. So what it does, if you think about it, what a lockdown does, it basically just forces people to go into another area. And it forces the very ones that you're probably concerned about to do so. You're actually encouraging <laughs> that spread. Where, whereas if you had just sort of let things stay open within that community, probably people would have just stayed within that community because they, they can do everything they want to do inside that community. But because of the lockdown, you're actually encouraging people 
to spread it out, to <laughs> kind of take it from one community and move it to the next. Um, so if you think about it, lockdowns really don't make much sense uh, just from this one perspective. And actually, I don't think they make sense from many other perspectives too. But just from this one perspective, lockdowns don't make any sense. And I want people to have freedom. <laughs> and I hope that governments will realize soon, hopefully soon, that lockdowns just don't work and they're stupid on many levels. So I'd like to hear your comments below, what you think uh, we should do, if we should have lockdowns or no lockdowns. What are your reasoning reasonings for why a lockdown is good or why they're bad? I'd just love to hear your feedback and get some conversations going. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.